All righty. Um, real quickly, I'll make this super fast. Um, got the piano set up, and uh, you can see I pulled the strings off, got the pins out. And I'm going to start working on getting this molding off from the inside of the cabinet here. See here, I got one piece out. And I'm going to number it as I take it out, hoping to not break any. Um, have a pretty hard time finding any more of that if, if that's broken. So um, one other quick thing I want to show you here, and I'd love to, let's see if I can get a light to help seeing this, um, some dates, rather old dates here, uh, tuning dates. You see here, um, I'm going to try to clean this up a little bit more, but you uh, got here, I don't know if you can make that out. If you can make that out and comment on it, I'd be grateful. Um, I'll try to clean that up a little bit. But obviously, we can see 1878 here and 1879. Um, what's that, June 17 and July, like July 4th. But those are obviously dates that the piano was tuned. And on down here, got an 1890, maybe 1890 or 1893. Um, I can't make that name out, but again, I may try to clean this up a little bit if I can do so without um, taking the lead off from the pencils. There's a Frank R. Davis. Um, it's that Alton. Alton. I cannot. I don't know what that is. Uh, but there's a date of August, what's that, August 18, 1897, and uh, November 2nd, 18, 1898, maybe. And then here's another one, J.C. Bentley, I think that's what that says. Bethany Bentley, um, like I said, 1914. It's real hard to make out. Um, tuned. I don't know what that is. If you can figure that out, uh, post it in the comments. But anyway, I always find it pretty neat to find those dates and stuff. There are a few other things scribbled. Um, on some parts too. I'll try to get some quick videos, but I just wanted to get a quick uh, view of this. This rosewood is really nice, and some of you uh, rebuilders, if you're looking at this, you can attest to the rosewood as you uh, sand it. I've sanded a couple of spots here. Very uh, aromatic. I love the odor. Um, although it shouldn't inhale the dust, my sander actually. Um, Vacuums the dust up as I sand, but um, wow, it really it really puts out a very nice, pleasant uh, odor. Uh, but in any case, I'll have plenty of hand sanding on here, as you can see. And uh, just check back in a little later. I'll post some more stuff. I'm going to try to move along pretty quick on this. Uh, probably in the next video, I'll have this played out, uh, working the soundboard and uh, working inside this cabinet. So uh, thanks for watching, and uh, just check out some of the other videos. If, uh, if your interest is only in this piano, just check back periodically, and you'll see some more stuff posted on this. Thanks for watching.